Hello everybody, it's your girl Celine again and you're most welcome to my channel. Previously, I did a video talking about how my council house is looking like when I had a key a month ago. If you have not checked that video out, you can check it out and so you can understand the transformation I'm going to speak about. Now, in today's video, I am going to be showing you some of the decorations I've been able to make in my council house and how the house is looking at the moment what I have done so far in my council house. Like, you know, when you receive a council house, normally it doesn't come with so many things. It comes with just the basic things that you would need in the house, like the washing machine, the cooker, um, electricity, and all those things. But any other thing, you just have to make sure you get it in your house to make it how you like it. And so when I had my council house, that was how, because most of the things we did it ourselves and that has actually given us some experience and it has also shown us where to get certain items if you're working on your houses and, and so on. So if you need help with anything too, don't, don't worry, just leave it in the comment section and I'll do well to share it um, in the comment section. So guys, this is... This is just to show you how my council house looks now. Let's get going. Yep, and from the hallway, as you can see, the colors are no more like it was before. Um, before it was um, like kind of blue thing, and now it's all white, all thanks to my husband. <laughs> he helped me to do the painting and the wallpaper and other things, so I, I wanna say thank you to him, yeah. So, oh, like, this is how the hallway also looks like. And then you come to the kitchen. Uh, the kitchen, I did it myself. <laughs> you just need some minor tools to get the kitchen done. You know, previously, the colors were a bit dull. Um, it didn't have what I wanted in my kitchen. The board was a certain color, like brownish, stylish, something else. But I needed something a little bit more than I, so I went for this this design with this color which i think it's really really nice it combines like itself very well and it makes the kitchen looks more brighter than before and so i it makes me love the kitchen more i don't love to cook that much but ever since <laughs> i love to cook because the kitchen you know kitchen is where everything happens so if you kind of find a very beautiful kitchen it makes things more like easier and good for you so so far this is how i have decorated like, like the kitchen yeah this is how far i've come with it with the kitchen decoration which I like all these things we got them from B and Q. There are some minor minor things I got them from B and Q because that place is kind of like a house shop. You get everything that you want to put in the house over there. So guys, let me know what you think um, about my new kitchen. I love it, and so <laughs> I know you will like it. So right from the hallway, you know, we we'll go to the living room, and this is so far this is how it looks like even though i'm still decorating it at least it looks better than before um if you've watched my previous video about um me having the council house and how it was looking i'm sure you will they kind of have stuff for houses and so on forth and the curtains i think it was also from b and q they have the flowers and other things and these ones also, I think they are, they are all from B and Q. Yeah, this one too. So, so far, this is how my living room is at the moment. Yeah. Let me know what you think about if it looks cool as I am, I am thinking. But for me, it looks okay. Yes. And from there, if you move to the next place, it's my daughter's room. Like I said the other day, put the light on so it can be a bit brighter. So that's how I managed to decorate my daughter's room. Yeah, with some of her books and the bags over here. She loves, um, what do you call it? 
uh, rainbows and, and unicorns so I decided to use this wallpaper as you can see there is a rainbow and there is a unicorn over there so she loves it so 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 much yeah and I decided to leave this blue uh, wallpaper because she loves it also she loves the color blue so I didn't bother and over here it's a uh, what do you call it a London bus <laughs> she loves London buses and that's her bed yes and if you're seeing this I'm, I'm sure you'll be asking why do i have a baby cot <laughs> in her room well she's soon like i'm a soon to be mom like i said <laughs> so i'm getting things ready and that's why you see that in her room at the moment so that's the outcome for now there are some minor minor decorations we're still doing and i will be updating you guys let me know what you think about the decoration so far in the comment section if you like the combination of the colors and so on